Does your toilet start to fill when not in use? The most common cause of this is a faulty flapper. The flapper is designed to hold the water in the tank until it's ready to be flushed into the bowl. In this example, it's clear to see that the water is leaking by the flapper and into the bowl. Some scenarios, it's much harder to determine if the flapper is leaking by, and you can add food coloring to the tank. If the food coloring leaches into the bowl, then you know the flapper is leaking. Once getting the correct flapper for your tank, we can start with the replacement. Drain down the tank by flushing the toilet. Remove the old flapper by disconnecting it from the flush valve and toilet handle arm. Remove the hook from the flapper chain and install the new flapper over the flush valve. Be careful not to drop any parts into the toilet tank. Hold the chain tight but ensure the flapper remains flat against the flush valve. Line up the chain link with the hole in the toilet handle. This is where the chain hook will be installed. This will leave enough slack in the chain so that the flapper remains in contact with the flush valve. If the chain tail is too long and getting in the way of the function of the toilet, you can either cut it off or loop it back in itself. Allow the tank to fill to check that the flapper seals and the toilet flushes properly. Hello fellow DIYers, I hope this video helped you out and possibly save you some time and money. If you like videos like this one, feel free to subscribe. Tap our logo and hit the subscribe button. This will keep you updated on all our newest content. And remember folks, never stop learning.